Welcome to the final episode of this career mode. I think I'm going to be stopping after this one, so I have to make this count. It has to be the special ending we all want, and that, of course, is winning the Champions League. We are into the final. We're going to go ahead and go through my objectives really quick before I reveal who we are facing in the final. So our objectives, our main objectives this season was one, to win the league title. We've achieved that. We had a couple of games left. We'd already won it. So that is in the bag. The Champions League objective was just to reach the final. Well, I say just reach the final. Remember, this is our first season in the Champions League. Imagine you're a team that you've just got into the Champions League. You've never played in the Champions League before. And your board say, oh, we want you to get to the final, please. Obviously, it's based on current results, current form, and also how high rated your squad is. So... With our team 100% justified, we should be getting into the final. Technically, we should be winning it, and we are one game away from doing that. We are in the final. We were expected to reach the semi-finals of the Spanish Cup. Unfortunately, we got knocked out in the quarterfinals. But uh, 72 manager rating, I'm not so sure that's very fair. Seems a little bit harsh to me, harsh to me considering how well we've actually been doing this season. But it is time now to find out who we're playing in the Champions League. I already know who it is. I said in the last episode between Liverpool and Spurs that I would rather play Spurs. I feel like Liverpool could potentially tear me apart if they've kept their main players. You know, Salah, Mane, Firmino, all of those great strikers and wingers. I would rather Tottenham. And guess what, guys? We've got Tottenham. We are going to be destroying them. OK, well, probably not. But we're going to win this game because as an Arsenal fan... You know, I'm, I'm very well known to be a, an outspoken Arsenal fan. And I, I'm, I'm, I'm friendly somewhat with my words towards Tottenham when we play against them. But of course, I hate them. I hate Tottenham and I cannot and will not lose to Tottenham. OK, there's just no way. Quote me on it. We will not lose this Champions League final to Tottenham. At least if I do, I just, how can I show my face ever again? How? Um, Fiorentina have won the Europa League. Interesting. Very interesting. Atletico Madrid have won the Spanish Cup. We'll go through all the other tournaments and other leagues after this game. Here we go. Time to set up the team for the Tottenham game. We're going to be playing in our home shirt. We're playing at the, oh, the Schalke Stadium. Arena of Schalke. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure that's the Schalke Stadium. It's in the name. So what do I do with my team? As you know, in the second leg... Yesterday against PSG, we switched to 3-5-2 or a 3... Was it a... Th uh, what formation was it? It was... I had a DM, two centre mids, then the wingers and two strikers. So it worked really well, but it was very difficult to defend against them. And I don't think I really want to do that in this match. I think I'm going to stick with my usual 4-3-3 with the attacking mid. So Linz does come in. Neto up top, Roche and Montenegro, they have to stay. Guerin and Gocek, yeah, do you know what? I'm going for it. This is the team we're going to use. The bench are all fully fit. I can bring on Diaz. I can bring on so many great players. Um, for this game, I think it's only fair, seeing as it is the Champions League final. We are going to go up to six minutes. I normally play on five in big, big games in the finals, but uh, we'll go to six just for this video. And let's see... If we can beat Tottenham, I'm really interested to see their lineup. I know they've still got Harry Kane, but still, do they have Deli Ali? Do they have Ericsson? All of these great star players. The biggest game in the series, guys. This is it. This is like the at the beginning. This is the the game I look forward to. The game that I'm aiming for. This is the target, the goal, the objective. This is everything that I've been working for with this squad. A squad that started with pretty average, but some decent players. And now is, I would say, the best team in the game. There is no doubt about it. On paper, we are the strongest team in the game. We've got some of the best players in the world. Tottenham. Tottenham are the final team we're going to be playing against here. You've seen my lineup. It is a ridiculous team. I would say the average rating, you know, if you add all of the, the, uh, the ratings and then divide them by how many players we've got. The average, I would say, is about 87. It, it's probably very high. 88, maybe. We have a lot of incredible talent in this squad. For the final time, let's get a group picture here. Oh, isn't it wonderful? My beloved Girona. I've had so much fun building this squad, but I am going to be ending the series after this game. Whether I win this Champions League final or not, 
I can see the dip in views. I can see people asking for new content. So uh, this is it, guys. The final game of this series. So Tottenham, Timo Horn, Pereira, Sanchez, Harry Kane is in there. They've signed Balm in there. On the bench, they've got some big names. Harry Winks will be a good player by now. De Hood is in there. Eriksen has stayed. Elianusi on the left. Hakimi at left back. Okay. Fair play to Tottenham. They've built a nice squad as well, but it's nowhere near as good as ours. We will be lifting that trophy at the end of this game. Mark my words. The question is, do I just want to go all out attack, try and embarrass them? Or do I play it safe and just hope that I can get keep that in? Oh, hope I can just get the odd goal and just defend for the rest of the game. I don't know if I want to be defensive, you know, not against Tottenham. I want to score goals against them and I want to beat them by two or three if I can. So I'm going to go for it. I'm going to attack as soon as I get the ball in this match. I'm going for it right for the throat. Looks like it's going to be Tottenham on the first attack of the game, though. Here is Delhi Ali. He's going to cross it, surely. Is he going to cross it? He's taking his sweet time. He's got it back. It's a good ball in, but no one's going to be there. Neto's not going to get there in time. It's okay. They can have a little bit of possession if they want. Anything to make them feel settled. And then bang! I'm going to hit them on the break, all right? Here's Hakimi. Oh, God. Oh, no. I couldn't clear it. Oh my god, just seven minutes in. Okay, Matt. Okay. No, that's that's fine. You know, this 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 has happened a lot. We do concede early goals. It's just something we've been doing recently. Against PSG, for example. How did Hakimi hit the post from there? And then C says just like, yeah, go on, Ericsson, have a chance. Yeah, we're we're just giving them that goal to make them feel like they've got a chance. Okay. Tottenham don't really have a chance. Okay, we're gonna get back in this game straight away. At least I hope so. Anyway, we've got more time than usual because we're playing on the uh, six minutes. That should give us enough time in this game to score 27 goals against them. Okay, that's not going to happen, but I would love it to. Here is Neto now across to Montenegro. Oh, what a ball that is for Guerin. Going to turn onto his right. Oh, that was close. Oh, man, Militao. I don't know how to say his name. He's the, uh, the new brazilian defender that's going to sign for real madrid right he's the new ramos they're saying oh thank you very much oh, i've just given it straight back hey we've we've got the throw instead though but he's a very good defender he looks to be one for the future for sure now here's montenegro into go check maybe no nope. too late and they get the ball back i don't really want to skip any of this guys i want you guys to watch the entire match so you'll have to put up with slightly less interesting commentary maybe as i'm playing but uh, we're going to do one long game for you guys so you can see the entire final. Harry Kane over here to Elianusi. Good signing as well, but he's not done well there. Okay, we'll pass that across to Montenegro. Go on, Neto. Make a run. Oh, I've just wasted that. I'm going to go on high pressure. Team press. I want to get this ball back every time as soon as I can. But here come Tottenham again. No, you don't. Thank you very much. Play that across. This time we get Neto through. Okay, right. What do we do here? What do we do? Pass that inside. Here is Roche. Finesse it. Still got it. No, I don't. De Hood is a great signing as well. I actually think he would suit Tottenham in real life very well. I, I'm a big fan of De Hood. I hope he doesn't go to someone like Tottenham. But a uh, great player. Oh, here we go. Go on, Linz. Go on. Oh, it's hit the bar. Timo Horn was beaten. Don't tell me otherwise. He hit the bar there. It was it was going in otherwise. There was no way the keeper was, was saving that. Should be one all. Very unlucky from Linz. Keeping the pressure on the uh, Tottenham defence here. But they've, they've got themselves out of trouble very well there. What a pass that is as well. Is he going to keep it in? He is. Ricardo Pereira, one of my favourite right backs in the game. Oh no. No, 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 no. Go away, Harry Kane. Oh, what a strike. See, that's the thing with Harry Kane. He may not be the quickest, but he's great at holding up the play. And, of course, his finishing is perfection. It really is. And I'm definitely struggling defensively in this game. Maybe I should have gone with three at the back. Maybe five at the back, just to hit them on the break a little bit more. Just hit that one out if I can. Okay, that's a throw. Why does my nose always get itchy in really important moments? Is it because I'm nervous and I'm creating itchiness? Oh, man. Okay, here's Neto. Montenegro, could we could maybe try and get him in. Pass that to Linz. Okay, come on, just keep running. Pass it through for Roche if I can. Oh, mistake. 
what 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 just happened there? Okay, we've got it back, have we? Yep. Give that to Roche. Straight inside for Neto. Overlap. Go on, Linz. Go on, Linz. Go on. It was a good pass. I think that's going to be our throw. We're 31 minutes in already, guys. This game is going very quickly. Let's quickly throw that to Montenegro. Pass it inside. Oh, and again, Dahoud is there. I'm not playing very well right now, but we have got time. I've got to just remember that. Try to give that to go check. Back to Guerin. You know what's coming, guys. The finesse shot. Nah, it's been deflected, I think. No, it hasn't. It wasn't even deflected. It was just a bad shot. I was saying in yesterday's episode how you don't see him miss those very often, but that's because I cut them out. You're going to see that one. He doesn't score them all. All right, here's go check now. Little fake shot inside while still sprinting. Tottenham are defending well. Yeah, they really are. Oh, almost got that. Go on. Yes, Neto. Yes, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Oh, we got so lucky there. Go on. What a, ta what a bit of skill. Oh, please keep that. Keep it. Oh. <sighs> Is it going to be one of those games, guys? Is it really? No, nope, Rivera. Okay, that. Yeah, let's go, let's go. Give it to Neto. Nice. Linz. Oh. Oh, my God. Again, the touch has just let him down. It's coming, though, isn't it? You can see I'm, I'm working my way slowly through this defence. It will happen. And they haven't really done anything for a little bit now. Have I jinxed it? Are they gonna are they gonna score now though? Even Montenegro is getting back for this one. Pereira, is he gonna cross it? Nope, he's cut back. He's gone for the cross this time, but that's not gonna beat Cisse. Right, let's just go. Oh, what have I done? Yes, we got it back. Right, Roche, this is your moment. This is your moment. Put it over the top. This is it, guys. Right before half time. Need to get him on that left foot though. Oof. <laughs> Almost a penalty. Here's Rivera now. Into the box. What a ball. Wow. Okay. Timo Horn with one of the best saves I have ever seen in a career mode. That is unbelievable. How is he saving that? Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Okay. Come on. Oh, my God. That's actually going to help me. That's actually helped me. Oh, go on. Go on. Go on. Go on. Go on. Go on. Oh. Corner it is. This is it. Last chance before the break. It's a good delivery. Neto's there. It's going to be another corner. We get another chance. Oh my god. I don't like this at all. I can't lose to Tottenham. Surely not. I need a goal. Go on, Reina. Oh, and Cissé's not going to be there. That's going to be half time. Well, hopefully you're enjoying the game. I'm certainly not. We are losing right now. You've seen every second of that first half. I would say I have been on top. The stats are in my favour at the moment, but... Look at the bottom, 77% passing accuracy is just not good enough. I have to pass the ball better. I absolutely have to. We're going to stick with this team at the moment. Don't think the team is necessarily doing anything wrong, except from the goal that we conceded, which was a little bit of a heavy touch from Cissé. Not much I could have done about it. It's just the way that is sometimes. Right, Rivera. We're going to try and get this passing accuracy up a little bit more in this half. But of course... As long as it's a pass that's worth making. There's no point in doing passes just for the sake of it. I see that in football a lot. Teams just passing it for the sake of it. If it's not a pass that's going to get you anywhere, what is the point, you know? So here's Neto. Give that to go check. Okay, Roche. We're going to have to put you in on the right wing. Jeez, that defender was quick to get back. Um, was that not a slight obstruction there? I thought it might have been a foul, but fair enough. Maybe not. Oh, I'm not going to get there. Right, Cissé, you're going to have to chase Delhi here. He's going to make a run again. Rivera's there. Trying to force out wide, and it has it has worked. Now here's Linz. Okay. Put it over the top for Montenegro. Oh, my God. What is that pass? Overhit it massively. We need something soon. Otherwise, I'm going to start really getting worried about this game. Can't lose to Tottenham. Just it's it's just not comprehensible. Okay, it can't happen, but it could. It genuinely could happen because I'm not playing well right now. Come on, don't score again. Yes, he say. Get up, Harry. Get up. Right. Oh, come on. Thought I got that to Linz. Oh no. 
Right, we are going to throw this out, but to the near player, we're not going to give it away like an idiot, like I have been doing recently. Okay, all through for Linz. There we go. This is it. Look at Roche. Look at Neto. Inside. Oh, my God. It's my bad. I didn't really mean to do that. We've got it back, though. Here's Roche. Nice scoop, but Barman saw that coming, didn't he? 60 minutes already, guys. They're making a change. I think I'm going to as well, actually. I'm actually going to take Linz off, and I'm going to bring in my new player, Diaz. And I'm also thinking Barre instead of Montenegro. Montenegro's been an incredible player for us, but he's not doing anything in this game. Barre is just more direct, I feel like. So we're just going to go with him. Oh, I thought about passing it back to my right back there, but that's okay. Kept the ball nicely here. Nice play. Oh, my God. Close, but not close enough. Should get there. No, Rainer's missed it. This doesn't feel good at all. Here's Ericsson now. Going to be careful of the overlap. Oh, no. Defenders are all over the place. There we go. Cissé's in there. Nice. Over the top. What a ball. Okay, now Neto. Just put him in forward. Come on. Look at Roche. He could get in space here. Oh, oh my God. They just closed me down so quick. Good ball. Oh. It's coming. It's coming, I promise. He's going to keep that in. No, he's not. The goal is coming. It is. It is coming. That's a lovely ball. That is a great ball. Just got no one to pass to. Oh. Oh. How? How am I not scoring there? I, I don't know. I can't answer that question. Yes, here we go. Diaz. Come on! Yes! Diaz is the hero. I took off Linz. I thought maybe, jeez, that's maybe a mistake. But no, Diaz comes on and scores the most important goal of this series so far. He had so much space from this pass. Look at that. Tottenham just had a lapse in concentration, clearly. Right, now we just need one more. One more goal. Oh, man, my throat is killing me. I've been talking too much. Right. <sighs> oh, they've given it back. Thank you very much. No way am I going to do this now. Okay, okay. Yep. Yeah. A little bit lethargic there, Neto. But look at this. Go check. Roche. Finish it. Oh. That would have been so nice to score two in quick succession. A misery compiler. But no. There's still 18 minutes left in this game. Come on, Rivera. Win that. Okay. Elianusi's better in the air than Rivera. Got it. Surely he's not better here, though. Rivera's got a great tackle on him. No, I've, I've missed it. That's my bad. And Delhi's just giving it away. Wait, why are you sliding in? Try to just cross it out. Just hit, hit it with a, a cross lob pass. That's it, a lobbed pass. But nope. Decided to slide in. They've got nowhere to go here. Good pressure from the lads. Oh, okay. Ericsson freed up some space. Got to be careful here. Yes. Wait, what? Offside? Was offside, or at least it was a foul. Elianusi's coming off. I think I'm going to make another change as well. Look at Guerin, he's exhausted. We're going to bring in Renaud, final sub. And Renaud has been one of my best players recently, so he just helps us defensively a little bit. We've got a little bit more possession than Tottenham, but by 2%, though, well, technically 4%. We haven't done much more than, than them, have we? It's been a very tight game. Oh, he's on, he's on, he's on, he's on side, surely. He is. No! I was watching the linesman. He didn't lift his flag for ages. How close was it? Yeah, he's offside <laughs> by a little bit. Right, we don't want this going to extra time because I've made all my subs. Ideally, we want to end this in the 90 minutes. But it, it could very easily go to extra time this game. It feels like it might be. And I think they've made two subs, haven't they? So they've still got one... One to go. Oh my god. That could have been a very good cross. We've still got 10 minutes including injury time though. So there's plenty of time to get this second goal. It's just whether or not I can actually do it. Because Tottenham have been very good defensively. Until that goal. Okay we'll pass that to Barre. He's actually been very good since coming on. He's just. He's a brilliant direct player. As I said he just runs at them. Okay keep the ball here. Nice. 
I mean, Diaz made a great run there, but I didn't want to risk passing it inside. Now, here's Neto. Oh, just got nowhere to go. I didn't want to cross it. Okay, here we go. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Keep it. Nice. 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 It was almost nice. It was almost nice there. That that might be our last chance, guys. I don't know if I'm if I'm going to get much more time. What a game this has been, though. Really cagey affair. And you can tell I really, really don't want to lose this game. I just... If I lose to Tottenham, I will never hear the end of that for a good few weeks in my video comments. Chase that down. Come on. Come on. Chase it. Chase them down. There we go. Last chance. Come on. Nice. Over onto the right wing. Oh my god, that was terrible, but we've got it. Go on, Rivera. No, he's just not going to have the speed. Play on, play on. Come on. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Back post. No! Look at Beret. He's, he's right there, and I put power on that, thinking I'd get it to him. There's still time. Oh. I need a drink. God. Insane. Absolutely insane. Look at the stats. My pass accuracy is a bit better. Still not great, though. What do I want to do here? Leave it as it is, I guess. Extra time, guys. The Champions League final is going to extra time. Right. Got to do something here. Got to score. If it goes to penalties, I will not win. I just won't. All right, you can see he's got fresh legs. Hooray. Okay, come on. Just just something. There we go. Bit of space. Yes. Oh, who just got there. Give a penalty if you want, mate. Go on, dink it in. Go on. Okay, no one there. Just win the header. Nice. Looks like they are sitting back a little bit, aren't they? Have they taken Harry Kane off? I think they have. They've got a new number nine in there. Oh, my God. Oh, it was such a good run. Who's their new striker then? Nemecha. Interesting. Right. Win that. Nice. Yes, here we go. Just run, Beret. Run. Inside to Neto. Look at Diaz. Diaz is in. Please finish it, Diaz. He is the hero. <laughs> Diaz gets his second game. Second goal of the game. I can't even think right now. <sighs> okay, now we just hold on and try and score a third. If we get an opportunity, I will go. But otherwise, I am not losing this. I need to defend. I've got to be careful. But he is the hero so far, Diaz. 99th minute. <sighs> just insane. Insane game so far. Just hold on now. Please just don't do anything stupid, Matt. We're going to go with... No, I don't want to use attacking fullbacks, that's for sure. I don't want to go and change tactics now because it is working for me. Renaud coming in has clearly helped a little bit as well. Oh, no. Okay, that's not bad. Just waste a little bit of time with the ball here. <laughs> I hate you, Tottenham. I hate you so much. We have to win this game, mainly because of that and because it's the Champions League final. You know, and it's the one competition I haven't won yet. Come on. Let's just keep the ball. We'll get this to uh, extra time, half time. In fact, we might we might actually get in. You never know. Let's see if we can do something here with Roche. Just get this in for Neto. It's a good ball, that. Oh, very close. We'll try it again, I think. Good ball. Beret is there. Oh, onto the roof of the net. And they're making another change. So clearly they had... A couple of subs to make still. I thought they made a couple of changes already. Okay, Pereira's come off. Interesting. Should win that header. Oh, no. Okay, half time. <laughs> We're getting there, guys. We're getting there. Come on. Come on. We've got this. We've 100% got this. Just don't concede a stupid goal. If I concede a worldie, you know, a proper incredible goal, I won't complain about it. If I concede a goal that is clearly my fault or just a stupid EA AIDS type goal, then that's a different story, okay? That might not go down so well in my head. But they can pass it all they want around at the back here. 
They're not progressing. They're not they're not getting anything done back there, that's for sure. There you go, Rivera. And now Roche is in. Come on. <laughs> Come on, here comes the third goal. Roche is exhausted. Give that to Beret. To Renaud. Into the box for Neto. Neto gets in there. <laughs> He's done it. Game over. Tottenham go back to North London and cry. There is no way they're coming back from this. And we are going to be European champions in our first season. In extra time as well. Boy, did I need that. Lovely pass to Renaud. The cross in was perfection. And what a volley. Timo Horn has made some great saves in this game. He probably could have done better there. 111th minute. <laughs> Jesus. So they need three goals to win unless it's going to go to penalties. They need two. I'm not conceding two goals. Mark my words. It ain't going to happen. Here's Ruben Vezo. Passes it to Castell. For a second I thought I was going to go in. <laughs> He's a centre back playing at right back. I know he can play there though, can't he? Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Diaz in for a hat trick. Let's dink Timo Horn. No! That was a hat trick for Diaz. And it comes off the bar. Second time we've hit the bar in this game. Diaz deserved it. If that went in, I probably would have cried a little bit. Because that would have been absolutely incredible. Would have been one of my best goals I've scored with this team. But Tottenham, once again, they're dominating possession, but in their own half. What are they doing? You need to hit the ball forward now. Look at this. What are they? Look at them just giving it away as well. And again, it's going to be a foul. So I'm going to run away. I can't. I can't run away. They're going to take this free kick, but they have minutes left. They do not have enough time in this game to make a comeback. It is over. It's over. There's no way. There's still time for more. Get that two beret. Oh, excuse me. Come on. Just first time cross. Oh, oh, Diaz again, close to scoring. It's injury time. This is it. Final moments of the game. They've given it away again. By no means is this a masterclass. I haven't played particularly well, but I'm still going to be beating Tottenham. Come on, another cross coming in. It's Diaz. No, he couldn't get his, his hat trick in the last second, but that is it. It doesn't matter. Come on. I'm so happy that I won it. Knowing that I was finishing this series, there was no other way than to go out with a win. The Champions League had to be mine, and I've done it. So I'm really, really, really relieved. Because it was a tough game. There were moments where I just thought it's not going to happen for me. But it's done. What a team. I've got another video on my mind where I want to wrap this career mode up. I want to talk about all of my favourite things. I wanna, I'm going to build ultimate team cards based on what their stats would be and show you how good these players really are. But this is the moment we've been waiting for, guys. Come on, Reyna. Get up there and lift this trophy. I said at the start of the season, when we lifted up the, the first trophy of the season, that it would be us in this very same scene lifting the Champions League trophy at the end of this season. And here we are. So, so pleased with this. Come on, lift it up. Lift it up, Reyna. Next to the hero of today. Brilliant. Diaz was the game changer today. He was incredible. I'm sad I'm not going to get to use him for much longer. He was a late signing. He only played eight games or something like that. So didn't really have a massive impact. But what an impact it was in the Champions League final. I mean, what more could you want from a player? He could have scored four or five. He really could. Oh, I'm so pleased, guys. It is over, though. The end of the series. And we end it on a high, though. Just what a feeling. Five years of building this team and we are the champions of Europe. So I will update you on all of the other leagues, other trophies, all of the stuff that I want to talk about in the next episode. It's going to be a Girona career mode roundup video. We're going to go through everything. I cannot wait to make those ultimate team cards as well. I'm going to do that right after I hit stop recording here. So we're going to have a look at how good these players would be if they were in ultimate team. There are some incredible stats, like incredible. We'll look at all the top scorers, top assists, most appearances, all of that stuff in the next episode. But for now, thank you for watching. I need to go rest my voice. I need to rest my mind. That was an incredibly tense game and we've ended the series on a massive high. So thank you for joining me along this journey. It's been incredible. One of my favorite career modes of all times. But we are going to do something different next. So keep your eye out for that. Make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you leave a like on the video if you've enjoyed it. 
and I will see you next time.